10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, It's the program. Oh, we're oh. on TV. It's blurry. Uh, well, once again, once a day, every day, turn on the machines and start talking. Talk, talk, talk. We're gonna be here for an hour or forever. Ooh, we're getting the. Uh, oh, you're talking in the, into the walkie-talkies. We're we're in Hollywood. Can't hear you. You got talking to a mic. You should know. Oh, give me the other one. We're uh, in, oh, oh, Jared's spilling beer. We're in Hollywood, kind of. We're um, south of Hollywood. Miracle Mile. What's this? Phone. Oh, phone. I already plugged in the thing for the phone. So, but this can be the phone also. Uh, Say something. I'll just talk through this thing. It'll sound terrible, but it'll be all right. Oh, yeah. Oh, shouldn't there be three mics, I thought, no? Oh. Yeah, there you go. Ah, okay. We're back at uh, Jessica's, but you can't see. Uh, Freddie, move the camera. <laughs> there, there you are. Oh. Uh oh. There's, a, there's, a there's an on button, but check. Oh, there it is. Yeah, it's coming through. Hey, check. Is it? Check. Yeah. Yeah, so we're broadcasting uh, to all of Thurston County. Yeah, hi Thurston County. We're in LA. Whoa, now it's getting dark. Sunset. Oh, whoa. Uh, how are you? Doing good. How are you? Real good. When was the last time you were on the program? Was it? Uh, yeah, it was October. We were here last in July. October. July. In July? We were in July. No. No. It was October. It was October. It was, it was October. Last oh. month, not, not like uh, last month either. Oh. But like thirteen uh, months ago. Over a year ago. I didn't realize that. But uh, Eric was here. Eric was here. In April, well, April, not here, but there. Oh yeah. Yeah. Oh right. <laughs> yeah. Mm -hmm. The well, here on the program. Leisure World, right? Yeah, Leisure there World. There here. Did you see that one? Mm -hmm. We're here on the program, but there in Thurston County. Here in Thurston here County. Here in Thurston County on tape, where we're on tape. We're here supporting Hot Rush Tour. Yeah, we're on Hot Rush Tour. We didn't make any Daily Hour shirts. I guess that's not going to be anybody's going to know so much. What happened to all those shirts? We had a bunch of Daily Hour shirts. You know what happened to those? Um, that was on episode 1,000 though, so that's like almost 2,000 days ago. I, I think they're, there's still one I have, but I think they all kind of got, um, you know, the people got them now. 2,000? Yeah. Oh. It was episode 2,000, we have the shirt. Still. 9,000 days ago, or 900 days ago. It's almost going to be episode 3,000 coming oh up. Oh my god. In, few, er, in December. That's so cool. What are you going to do? Uh, probably nothing. We're gonna do another episode of the program. <laughs> three thousand is uh, doesn't count because it, next one is only five thousand because you can't count three thousand because you go to one thousand and then two thousand and then you can kind of do three thousand but you really it's five thousand because uh, like it's like it's kind of like our RPGs you know. Mm -hmm. you ever played RPGs? Yes, sometimes, but not really. It's like. You know when you get the numbers and you start leveling, you need like a higher number to level. So it's like you can't just do every thousand. Exponential. Got it's it. exponential. So it's like five thousand is really the thing. So three thousand, we're kind of kind of mm -hmm. gonna say it, mm -hmm. acknowledge it, but. Mm -hmm. But you're just gonna jump ahead because that's how it works. But five thousand is another like two thousand episodes, so that's a lot. Anyway. Mm -hmm. But then after five thousand, then we can't do anything till ten thousand, which is really long. But we can still do things, but... I see. We have to, like, not... We have to do things, but it's like... You can't over-celebrate. Yeah, over-celebrate. can't over-celebrate. We can over-celebrate when we get to, um... 5,000. But I don't think, you know, I, th 
I don't see a problem over celebrating, but I see that I respect the decision to not. Yeah. Well, if we over celebrate on three thousand, then what are we gonna do on five thousand? That's like. Oh sure. Yeah. You got. Oh, please change batteries. The uh, we gotta get the those things plugged in. I got the power somewhere, but. I think things can always get better and better, you know. So you should just try for the best every time. Try for the best every time. I try for the middle every time. That way, it doesn't. I don't get tired, I guess. Or something. That's good too. What's uh? What's a Miracle Mile? I've never heard of this before. I've heard of other places. Oh, yeah. Um, this is the Tar Pits. Mm. And the uh, Los Angeles. Bray, what about La Brea, though? Yep. Yeah, that's it. The same. Well, they're here on La Brea yeah. and Olympic, if that means anything so to anybody. Is that area? It's called Miracle Mile? No, well, there are. There is a La Brea area, yeah. La Brea is a street? That is probably yeah, technically where. An area. It's probably technically where the, the Tar Pits are, I guess. It's called the La Brea Tar Pits. Yeah. Because of the street. But it's not even on La Brea. I think I saw the La Brea Tar Pits on The Simpsons. That's the only way I know about La Brea Tar Pits. Mm hmm Were they on some movie? Mm -hmm. What movie? Uh, Dino Man? The Forbidden Zone. Ooh. Oh, yeah. Good reference. Can you see Tar? Yeah. Did you go there? Yeah, you can see Tar. You could... There's also, there's like a room where you see them, like, cleaning dinosaur bones. They're still getting the bones out of there? They're still getting the bones out of there. Isn't tar, like... It oil. preserves them, actually. Oh, yeah, yeah, but is tar, like, oil? That I don't know. It's really it's oil, yeah. Isn't it, like, worth all money or something? <laughs> no, not tar. Not as much as dinosaurs. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> they didn't suck it all up. It's not black. It's like black gold, right? That's what they. That's oil, yeah. Like the Beverly Hillbillies. Yeah, but like they call it black gold, but like oil, you can buy it at the oh. store at the at the gas or the, like the car store, and it's only like three dollars for a bottle of oil. That's gas. Oh, oil. Oil, I guess. Well, they call it, but they make oil in the gas. Mhm. Mm but not car oil that you buy from the car no. store, right? That's like some, a different kind of oil? I think that's different. Yeah, like the other day we were talking about this um, gas station that has an oil rig next to it in Long Beach and how, you know, just talking about the difference between the oil that you get out of the ground. And you think it would be really fresh oil? Because yeah. there's an oil, like, mining thing right next to the gas station. Yeah. But I don't think it's the same oil. I think that oil goes across the country yeah. to get processed mm -hmm. and then maybe comes back like a year later as gas to that gas station. Mm -hmm. yeah. It's refined. Classy. Um, if those tar pits, they never like just like caught on fire or something in the sun? Not you that know? I'm aware of. No. I'm not aware of that at all. Seems like it's pretty hot out, and they get direct sunlight. But I don't know if you can d it would just catch on fire, because I guess it's been there, they've been there for a million mm. years. I don't know about that. It hasn't caught on fire yet. I definitely, just um, learned about the 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 size that the L the LA Library fire was. I didn't realize it was such a big thing. Oh yeah, like the library seemed like there would be really flammable. And I, gu I guess <laughs> the yeah. Los Angeles one was particularly so. They they kept they had an opportunity to fix it at some point um, where they were going to rebuild, but instead they decided to like fix the yeah. the building itself instead of rebuildings and stuff. So like and it went up in flames really easily. And there was an arsonist involved actually. Oh mm -hmm. no! Was couldn't read. He was mad. I forget what yeah. his deal was. Yeah, something. Um, yeah, twenty-two thousand books or something. Wow, because books are made out of paper, and that's what you like put in a fire. If you want to start a fire, you get paper. Mm, yeah. And that's that's too bad. Uh, and like um, tar made from dinosaurs. Anyway. I think so. But well they're not their bones. It's like the it's like everything but their bones turned into the tar, and then their bones just stayed there. <sighs> I think so. Or it must be older because the dinosaurs got they got stuck in the tar in the first place. Yeah. What was the tar? What was in the tar that the dinosaurs got stuck in? Yeah. Some like older, even older dinosaurs. Older stuff. Yeah, I think. Um, I heard that it's like it's like Stegosaurus and T. Rexes or something were like thousands of years apart. Mm. Oh yeah, I think that's true. Like a yeah, million stuff. So. 
Yeah. Your, your mic seems to be quiet. Yeah. I think it's two. It's this, this one. Two. There, there. Now it's real. Uh, That's uh, oh, now it's quiet. It, what's going on? Is it, it? Maybe it's probably just like a um. It's probably just like a weird uh connection, you know, just, like com- just cutting in and out. Oh uh, yeah. Oh well. I think it's working now. You see famous people here in Hollywood? So Eric has a job where he runs into weird z- zany keyboard famous people. Uh-huh. Mm-hmm. Somebody who passed away recently who was a funk legend. You you met Oh. Yeah. Wawa Watson. He played on Michael Jackson, Marvin oh. Gaye. Mm. But he's one of those people who should be a millionaire, but wasn't. He's no a session him. guy? Session guy. Very... Was he well off? He was okay. I don't think he was that well off. Huh. He passed away recently, and then... He died. He well, you told us the, the Nick Nolte story. Not on the program. Yeah. Uh. <laughs> Why don't you share it with the public? Um, Nick Nolte is a filthy individual. <laughs> I'm going to go on the record with that one. Um, yeah, he uh, brought some stuff into the shop, and it was completely covered in just w- wet filth. Mm. And um, from what I understand, all of his things are covered in wet filth. <laughs> they come in. Yeah. All you had to do was clean it up? Pretty much. Uh, mm-hmm. What's like the I guy with like the... F- the mm, mugshot is that like he's like famous for a mugshot? That's what I know about him. He's yes. Like, his hair is all crazy and stuff. Yes, that's the one. Yeah. Well, I don't know why. He, well, he was in Apocalypse Now, is it? Was he g- like one of the gunners on the ship in Apocalypse Now? Is that right? Sounds, Sounds right. right. Yeah, I think so. Sounds like someone who would have some issues later on. It's not like, it's like Gary Busey and Nick Nolte are like almost the same. <laughs> like yeah. the same person. Yeah. <laughs> Maybe Gary Busey was actually the guy in Apocalypse. <laughs> <laughs> is, this, is this working? No. They're both just like wild, like old dudes, I guess. What famous people have I seen recently? Um, it's like there's someone forgetting. Someone just in the lobby, right? That mic keeps like cutting in and out for some reason. I think it might be the cord. I don't know. Yeah. Oh, I saw Colin Jones from SNL once recently. Colin Jones? Jost. He does the. Uh, oh, Yost. Is it Yost? Jost. I don't um, know who that. He's he nothing new. He does the side, the the weekly report on SNL. Weekend update. Weekend update. Um, I haven't seen Saturday Night Live in a long time. Seen uh, RuPaul a couple times. Oh, you saw RuPaul? I love RuPaul. I watch that show. What was Ru- what's RuPaul doing? The thing is that I like I, w- I haven't been swept up. I wasn't swept up in the the drag race mm-hmm. cr- uh, craze like enough at all to uh, yeah. to be able to just like. Uh, be amazed by RuPaul. To be amazed, yeah. but then like to spot it right away because oh, like yeah. I'm used to seeing him in drag, mm-hmm. and I saw him not, and I was just mm. like, "Is that really though? Um, a lot taller than I thought. Yeah. Um, so beautiful. Yeah, I don't know. I've seen him a couple of times. Um, at the well, where we're chilling, waiting. Just chilling. Well, the thing is, he waits in the lobby every time I see him. He's waiting in the lobby for um, whoever he works with, and it's like, mm. why do you make RuPaul wait? Yeah. <laughs> Not in a hurry. <laughs> uh, that's that's good. RuPaul. I want to see RuPaul. I'm looking for famous people on mm-hmm. the street. I yeah, saw a couple of lookalikes. Whoa. Yeah, I keep saying uh, that I see them, but they're not actually them. I see on. Well now that the fires are happening, you might see like Lady Gaga or something running around. You know. Is that near her house or mm-hmm. something? She was one of the ones that evacuated. Oh. Running around like help me or something. You know? It's like the rich people's houses are getting fire on fire. A lot of them, yeah. But oh. It was Malibu. Uh. 
Mm-hmm. Yeah. They didn't, like, buy a wall or something, like a firewall or something. A fire, yeah. No. Real life firewall. Yeah. Yeah, I guess the fire went all the way to the ocean. Oh, oh yeah. I think a firewall is, like, named after a firewall, like an actual firewall with fire, right? It's basically just a type of insulation that is lasts for, like, up to an hour in a fire. Oh, okay. Oh. Yeah. Not uh, not permanent anyway. It just lasts slightly longer than the oh. regular material. A regular wall. Oh. When I hear oh. firewall, I think of like a wall of fire. <laughs> yeah. Oh, y- oh yeah. It's like you can't get you can't get what computer viruses through because it's on fire. That's what I used to think. Yeah. yeah. When I hear firewall, yeah. Oh, uh, <laughs> I always thought that it was a, the block fire blocking wall. Block that fire. Yeah. I think what they do to stop fires, I've sh- they had them in eastern Washington quite a bit, and in the plains and stuff, sometimes what they'll do is they'll do like a controlled burn on like a band around the edge of the fire, oh yeah. so that when the fire gets up to there, there's no more material that it can burn, and so it can't keep going forward. I don't know if they call that a firewall or not, but that's like one way that they do with that kind of stuff. Yeah. But I don't think you can do that in a residential area, because it's all like people's houses. Yeah. They, like actually burn down some like <laughs> to burn down official houses or something yeah lady gaga there. yeah it's house yeah that was the whole thing people are freaking out because it's in neighborhoods it's like yeah but you know they're they're way more like tree tree centric neighborhoods than like around here so mm. um it's weird but it's also like uh, well yeah there are a lot of trees over there we thought we saw the fire over the hill last year we saw it but it was actually like a building. I think we, we think it was the jail, but like we were driving down the freeway on the same spot last year and we looked over and we're like, we can see the fire, we can see the glowing over the hill, that's crazy. But this year we drove by the same spot and the same glowing spot was there. Yeah, for <laughs> there was, since the fires were on, we were like, maybe like, is there it's exactly the, yeah. But how could it be in the same exact <laughs> same spot every time? No, definitely. We think it was the jail now. Pleasant Valley Jail. Jail on fire? Yeah, <laughs> or I was just thinking that it was maybe like they have like spotlights out of the outside the jail because it's uh, dark because they in the and people try to run away and they need the lights or something and in, in the mm. yard they always have the lights on maybe. It was just a classic there. dumpster fire. It's not in the middle of nowhere. Yeah. Twice, two times in a row. Two yeah, commemorating hot year after year. Town. They they know yeah. yeah. I, I think you should probably keep on believing that. Lightly like all of SoCal is on fire constantly because yeah. it's not that far off. It's sort of, yeah. Every time we've been down here, there's been talk of it. <laughs> there's another fire. Well, it's been constant. Has it gone away since in the year? Or is it? It's, well, there were uh, summer fires. So, the, yeah, during spring, I guess, was when the time we took a break. Oh, you can't see tuna too well in the <laughs> in blending with the couch. Look, there's tuna. Yeah, it looked like you were oh, petting the, the an extension going? of my leg. What? You yeah. the other camera going? Get the other camera going. We should take a look at Tuna. Oh, you have to get it going? No, it's going. It's going. Let's see how Tuna is. We were at your place last year, but it's a different place. Tuna! Can we see it? Oh, it's dark, but... Tuna, say hi. Well, well, can uh, Tuna do uh, tricks? I think I asked you last year. Oh, uh, she can sit. Tuna, sit. Oh, good dog. <laughs> Lay down. Yeah, see? Can we clear it off? It's oh, give me the candle. Oh. Lighting. Is that me? We went to the table. Maybe. I don't know. There we go. Oh, oh Tuna. So, a little dark, but it's okay. Tuna's worried about the fire. <laughs> She's saying, yeah, hey, get that fire away from me. Why are you holding a fire from her face? So you guys are just she blew it out. Being on fire. Yeah. Oh, Tuna, smart. You know how to blow out candles? Tuna, what do you have to say to people? Whoa. Whoa. She went. I was, yeah, I heard Tuna bark early. We could, like, knock on the door to get Tuna to bark, but I think it's okay. We don't need to have her bark. Yeah, Tuna's three now. Is she really only three? Yeah, she is. Drinking dog ears. Yeah. Yeah. Time to party. Uh huh. It's the 
It's the white one, the white. I think it's the tennis. Behind Kenny's head. Oh. And then pull the white. Wow. Oh, wow. look at that. That's right. There's a big difference. Tuna! Yeah, tuna. Tuna's still blending in the couch a little bit, but we can see. Auto focus! She gets shot. really shy, yeah. Yeah. I put her, I take pictures of her all the time, and she does the same thing. What's uh, th what's this neighborhood known for? Probably the oh, tar pits. The tar pits, yeah. That's like. Oh, wait, right, wait, right, wait. Okay, Miracle Mile's Art Deco. Uh, uh oh. I don't think I don't Eric's mic is working. Why is it doing that? It has to be it's a bad cable. We got other cables. Oops. There's like that quarter inch is already, that one you already, quarter inch XR. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Could just be that microphone, too. It's kind of a piece of garbage. Uh, Art Deco. Deco. What is that? Uh, it's architectural style. What? Uh, like? It's very extravagant. Hmm. Yeah. I didn't. I don't know if I saw it. No, this house, but uh. most of them are gone because they're from olden times, and then there's only a few left. But a lot of the ones that are left are here. Miracle Mile. There's an Art Deco Staples. <laughs> Why is it called Art Deco? It's Art. art. It's like f it's a fifties thing, right? Or I'm pretty sure it's fifties. Um, and it's just it was an era where architecture was um, looking futuristic. We almost played at the uh, by the Steeple Center. Really? But it was like a whole couple blocks away at the Ham and Eggs or something. Ham and oh. Eggs. oh yeah. But what happened with that? They they uh, that fell through, so now we're playing at. Lot one. Lot one. Lot one, yeah. Lot one. It's hard to play shows in Los Angeles, even when you live here. Oh, yeah. I heard it I heard it's a, it was an upgrade. That's what it, those people said, that Lot One's an upgrade. I think it is an upgrade. It's an upgrade from Ham and Eggs. Oh, yeah. Ham and Eggs, I'm playing there next weekend. I've never been, but it got described. I know this is for the entire world, so I'll just make the reference, but it got des described as a chain reaction. And Chain Reaction is this little um, all-ages venue. Well, not little, but pretty little in Orange County that is notorious for like being a breeding ground of emo, screamo mm. um, music. Ah. A decade and a half or two decades ago. And it's still there, but it's like they'll throw like like throwback shows, you know? Like whoever will come to town and they'll throw a real show and you just, whatever, like it's normal. But the if you're a band and you want to play there, they make you sell tickets. <laughs> it's really silly. It's really silly because hey, it can just play. be an accessible all ages DIY venue, but instead it's like kind of just something like against it. Yeah. <laughs> Ugh. Anyway, Hammond Eggs supposedly looks a lot like that, where it's kind of like a long, a long rectangular room <laughs> at the end. <laughs> That's like a lot of places. The smells like that, yeah. Oh, yeah. it's got food. They have food, right? Ham and eggs? Yeah, do they have ham and eggs? They serve it? They oh. That's just a name? What? Wow. Uh, I would expect food. I'd be like, where's the food? I think there's other places. Where are my food. ham and eggs? Yeah. I'd be like, you have some food. Oh, Lot 1 does have food, huh? It does yeah. I think so. I played a Lot 1 last year during the World Series. Uh huh. Um, and th there was absolutely no one there. Oh because yeah. everyone was watching the Dodgers in the World yeah. Series. Oh, yeah, they won again, right? They were literally like around the corner at they Dodger Stadium oh, yeah. watching the Dodgers. They didn't win this year? No. no. They lost? No. Red oh. You told me they won. Yeah, we you thought. I, I wouldn't know. No, the Red Sox won. I thought they won. Oh, yeah, you told they me they won. Paying attention. <laughs> no, it was like exciting when they went, for sure. I, yeah. So did anything, did you see the, the people outside? Were they upset? Were they Riots in the streets, maybe? No, we don't. I think I wasn't in town. I don't really pay attention, but I just see that there's some kind of riot. People get really excited about getting excited, but then when it's time to be sad, no one really gets sad. Yeah. Oh, that's good. I, I like that. Sad in Los Angeles. <laughs> no, no one's I ever sad Boston in a riot because they won. Yeah. Oh. Yeah, that's the kind of place that seems that Boston seems like. Yeah. Yeah. Right. Well, he's just happy to have any sort of sports team, as it seems like. Whoa. Whoa. You know what I think about baseball? What? I, I don't understand why women can't play on baseball teams. Yeah, particularly. It's particularly, right? Like all sports, for sure. Well, there, did you ever see that movie, The League of Their Own? Yeah. They were, they almost, I think they almost were like, gonna do it. I think mm -hmm. it's, uh, I mean, yeah, it comes down to 
um, probably like patriarchal type things, really, because mm-hmm. it doesn't make any sense. It makes no sense at all. And I feel like their teams would be better for it. Yeah. And it would be more fun. Oh, there we go. Yeah. yeah. They, they didn't get their own. <laughs> they try. They, they try. You should put it on. <laughs> People are trying to play? Or are they asked to play? Yeah. Or it's just like, why not? Yeah. I think it's interesting too with other sports. I don't. I don't see why not for for football either, because like, um, first of all, we're all breaking down gender now. And I guess not everybody's gonna be up on that tip all the time, but it's like you can admit that th- like body type or strength really has nothing to do at this point with any weird old idea. So it's like weird that you can't even get past that. I like think rugby might be more accepting of women. I know this, I've got some friends who have women who are, are they maybe they're just on a women's rugby league, but I don't know. But yeah, it'd be nice for major league stuff to to talk about it for once, but maybe it's never going to happen. No, it will. It will. Eventually. It w- I think eventually what's going to happen is people are going to lose so much interest in sports, they're going to be like, oh, why wouldn't we put women in sports? It's hard to know. I, it's funny that sports really still... I mean, just like how you go to lot one and there's no one there because it's like a, f- a sports game. It's like strangely more people are into sports than like <laughs> many <laughs> things <laughs> like in culture. It's like very cultural for America somehow. Um, mm-hmm. And I like, I think playing sports is really fun. It's like a fun game, but it's amazing to me. I, honestly, it's a little confusing sometimes when it's so like everyone's into it. And internationally, it's soccer. Oh, yeah. Football. Soccer. Yeah. Do they do, like, um, is it also gendered teams yeah. in the, in yeah. the like, outdoor, yeah. Yeah, and, you know, like, that's a perfect example. Like, the, the women's USA team is just, like, kicking ass, and they have been consistently for, like, five years or something. And the men's USA team just, like, will not what? ever, like, figure it out. And it's like, wow. Like, you just know. Join up. Join forces. Yeah. What if one of those teams just decided to be the first team that was, you know, and then the rest of them were like, oh, fuck, we're getting our asses beat. <laughs> <laughs> and then <laughs> everyone else. <laughs> yeah, that's the thing. I mean, that's where th- I think then the plot of A League of Their Own, which was also oh real, right. they had to be really good because in order for them to be the first team to, like, make it happen, although they were actually, they were trying, I think they were trying to play against men's teams mm-hmm. or something like that, you know? Mm-hmm. But, like, in order to be a... Uh, maybe even a co-ed professional team, you'd probably have to be, like, insanely good and over-qualified. Oh, exactly, yeah. Yeah, like anything when women have to do with men. <laughs> <laughs> we got the, um, the Wi-Fi still from last year. Oh, cool. It's still working. Oh, yes, yeah, it's the same way. router. <laughs> yeah. Um, uh, maybe I'm going to call my grandmother. Can I put you on? I've been calling her and tell her we're in California. I've been calling her on the program a lot. We should maybe call Mr. Gensu too because well I, he hasn't talked to you about you in a while, but he's he he okay. he still thinks you're around or something. He like you're like the probably number like what he talks about Bird and Freddie and me and Carl and then he still says you, Jessica. Me? So yeah, so Jessica he thinks is still. Well, I talked to him not too long ago, I think. Yeah. All right, here we go. We're gonna call Grandma first. Uh, and Lacey, far away, Tuna! <laughs> oh, I think it's my mic that's feeding back. Yeah. Is it going? Is it? Oh, I don't know if it's going. Oh, no, it's, uh, thinking. The computer, or the phone is, uh, spinning right now. It's uh, gonna go pretty soon. Oh, no, it should be going. Uh-oh. Hello? Hello, Grandma? Mm. Uh oh. Hello, Grandma. Hi, how are you? Oh, okay. How are you? Good, what are you doing? Well, I talked to your father. Oh, yeah, what do you say? I don't know. Is he there? Yeah, he's there. You can talk to him, okay? Oh, well, yeah, I'm in California. You are in California, huh? Yeah. You have a good time? Yeah, I'm having a good time. Oh, girl, how are you doing over there with us? Not hot? It's, it's kind of hot. It's not too hot, I guess. How hot is it? 80. It's, like, it's cold for here. It's like 80, but it's too hot for me, so I want it to be like 40. Oh, okay. Yeah. 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 Okay.
Happy in the California. They say, have a great time, man. Okay. So when you come to, um, to come here, they send that you and tell me about the whole thing, okay? Okay. Okay, then. They are talking to you. Oh, yeah, it. Jessica knows my grandma. I'm with Jessica, grandma. Do you remember Jessica? She helped you, like, was well, just some yard work or something, like, a long time ago. Who are talking to? I'm um, you. I'm visiting Jessica. You remember Jessica from... That was like a long time ago, actually. I don't think you remember, probably. Yeah, I, I, I don't remember Jessica, man. You do remember? Yeah, I don't remember Jessica, then. She said hi. What? She says hi. Oh, yeah? He said hi. Okay, I say hi. How are you? Where's Where's Andrew? Andrew, hey, just Andrew, he talks to Andrew. Yeah. Okay, you can talk to him on the phone, too. Yeah, okay. You can, like, help, like... Okay. Uh, you can talk to your father, please. Oh, okay. Okay. Yeah. I don't know if you've ever been talking to him on the program before. Hello. Hi. Hey, how are you? Good, I'm in L.A. What's that, man? Oh, wow. Uh, wow. Did you drive down? Yeah, we drove in a van. Oh. Uh, what? Is there any fires what? on the way? There's smoke, lots of smoke. Yeah. There's supposed to be lots of fires, huh? Yeah. Wow. So, <laughs> when are you coming back? Uh, 18th. 18th. <laughs> I'm, I'm going to go down to California on the 17th. Oh, yeah, where? Five so from 15th. I'll come back on the 19th. Where? I'm going to Monterey. Where is that? Where? Is that where we are going to be at all? No? Nah, it's up north. We can't meet up. <laughs> yeah, Mon Monterey's over by um, San Francisco. On the 15th? Oh, I'm flying, flying down to um, Monterey. What day are we going to be there? <laughs> I don't know. Um, the afternoon, why? <laughs> so we can meet up with you. <laughs> You're going to be in Monterey? We're going to be in San Francisco. Oh, yeah. I won't uh, uh, it's about a couple hours away from San Francisco. Oh, okay. Probably too far. <laughs> yeah. Okay, let's talk to Andrew. Okay. Just a second. Here. Let's check you out. Everybody's there. Hello. Hi, Andrew. Hi. What do you for dinner? We're going to eat pork. Where are you at? What kind of pork? Pork, uh... Pork chop. I don't know. What are you gonna? What are you gonna? Eat? Uh, pork chops. Yeah. How are you gonna cook them? Like bake. What? Bake. Bake. Bake pork chops. Pork steak. Pork steak. <laughs> you don't call them pork steak. You call them pork chops. Pork chops is pork steak though. Yeah. Uh, I think so. I don't really know what steak, where steak comes from in the animal, in the so. cows. Well, I mean, it comes from cows, but like, it just seems to have the grabber. Huh? Which, uh, you know, like which part of cows? What, what the? What How come they don't have beef bacon? Well, you know, like the like cow belly. Yeah. You what know, that you know about that? Jeremy's got. Oh yeah, tripe. Tripe. No, that's like stomach, though. Oh. Uh, that's like, like guts belly. or something, yeah. I think. Cow bacon, you know? Yeah, cow bacon. I don't know. Like, tripe is like the actual, like, stomach that's like... Stomach lining. Yeah, that's stomach lining, like the part that where your food is. Intestines, yeah. Yeah, intestines and stuff. So, like, bacon is like next to the skin or something. But they don't have cow bacon. Yeah, what is that? Yeah, where's the cow bacon? I don't know what it, what it, it would it be. What would Kind of like brisket. It's probably something that we know. The brisket's not very bacony. No. Huh? About cow butt. Cow bacon. Cow butt. Beef butt. That's a thing. Pork butt. Pork butt. Cow butt. But pork pork butt is not the actual butt, isn't it? It's, it's the front it? shoulder. Yeah, pork butt is the shoulder. Ham is the butt. Pork butt is shoulder. Yeah. Ham. Are you, are you watching TV? <laughs> yeah. What are you watching? Pork butt, not butt. Pork butt is shoulder. Yeah, I'm watching the Anthony Bourdain. Oh yeah, he's still on there. The last episode. He would know. Is the very last episode he ever taped? 
I guess. Is it like right before he suicide? What? Did you tape it right before he kill himself? No, no, he was in France. It was the last one. But it was like he died in France, right? Yeah. So they like aired the episode like right before he died. They shot shot right before he died. No, but there is, he was in the middle of filming his season. So they but they they still released the season that he that whatever he did the final one. Yeah, except for the France one. Mm. Damn. Yeah. So that's no, yeah. What's uh, happened in Thurston County? Um. I don't know, nothing. Same stuff, huh? I'm not Same missing out. Happy day today, no rain. Oh, that's something. It seems to happen every time we go to California. It turns out that it's like pretty nice in Olympia, you know? Yeah. yeah. It wouldn't happen if you didn't leave, though. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, maybe not. Oh, dear grandma. Dad won a trophy. Well, Ooh. Dad won a trophy. Golf? Golf trophy. Wow. What place? First place. Wow. He's a golf average golfer. Out of what? Yeah. <laughs> how many yeah, how many people? He's he wins. Oh. How big is the tournament, Dad? Um, I mean, how many people? Quite a few. Quite a few, huh? I was always real uh, big disappointment because I was bad at real bad sports. So are you, yeah. Andrew. I'm not good. For bad sports, for just big disappointment, because he's pretty good. Oh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right. All right. Well, goodbye. Anyway. Or are you actually, you have, anybody else want to say anything to him? Or no? All right. Yes, I guess he's going to hang up. It sounds like they're, uh, they're, they're up there, you know, they're visiting or something. I think yeah, they're visiting. About to eat food. That's nice. Yeah. Nice, nice chat with him. Yeah. I don't think my dad's never been on the program before. I don't think my grandma really knows that I'm calling from the program. Yeah. Yeah. But it's, it's still, I think she likes to get called. No, your dad has been on the program and also does not know that he's on the <laughs> program. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Your grandma was notoriously tough on me when I worked for her. Oh, yeah? But I, you it's told okay. me it was going to be like that and I expected it. I thought it was oh, fun yeah. the whole time. Yeah. You were held to a high standard of work. Yeah. It was yeah. just getting dommed around. It was fine. She like yeah. she wouldn't pay me around. she wouldn't pay me until I was done with all the work. So I kept biking over to her <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> to finish the work. But it was kind of this like big project. Why why did you end up doing that in the first place? I was like, broke. Oh yeah, but you're, you're like I was like, well, you're broke. Remember my grandma will pay you to fix the yeah. yard. Well, Olympia was like, you know. There's no job. Yeah, yeah. And I was like, yeah. I was like, well, this isn't going well. So, you know, it was definitely around the time when I was uh, starting to think that I need to leave. Yeah. Oh. Mm. So it was. Yeah. She's never been happy with uh, any yard people ever. <laughs> right. yeah. I could sense that it was kind of this like, yeah, I've been burned before situation. Yeah. And I was like, that's fine. I'm not here to tell you I'm gonna do the most amazing job, but. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> She's like the, uh, I think that's what she, she enjoys yelling to go to, go to a restaurant. <laughs> she always yells uh, at them. <laughs> <laughs> we went to a buffet together. Do you remember that? Oh, mean Chinese? Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah? Mm -hmm. That's not too much of wait waiters there. No, so yeah. She doesn't have to worry nice. about too much. She, yeah. she seemed happy there, yeah. I haven't been there in a while. I can't eat buffets too much anymore because I, I don't eat as much as I used to, so now if I go to a buffet, I don't feel like I'm yeah. getting enough Can food. Yeah. Getting your money's worth? Yeah. I always get weirded out like, uh, like the concept of Vegas and all those adults like eating all those buffets because it's like, yeah. can you really still eat like that? I like, if I, if I go to a buffet, I like pretty much always get sick because I like won't stop because I'm like, I need to shove as much of this in my face. Take Gotta get your money's worth. Yeah, but that's like the value, the whole value thing. Now I just don't go. Because usually if I go to a restaurant, I get leftover. Yeah. So it's yeah. like, it's right. like more than I can eat. And they discourage that. Yeah, you get it all into your stomach. Well, no, you can't take food. You can't take food. Yeah, but it's so like, they, what they are you going to do with that? The end of the yeah. And it's the idea, it costs a little bit more, but you can eat as much as you want. Yeah. So you got to eat. A lot. Yeah, it's but usually I, not too much more than you would get anyway right. at a restaurant. I don't want to eat. I eat less than they give me anyway. So it's like all you can eat. I get when I go to a regular restaurant. It's usually more than I can eat already. And usually. And I just don't like the pressure. Yeah. Yeah. 
Yeah. They get you. That price is somewhere in between being expensive and not, and you're like, all right. Yeah. But it's worth it because I get as much as I want. Oh, I would like to argue in defense of the buffet mm. where it's not yeah, about too. the value or the eating variety? as much. Variety. Yeah, yeah. Variety. Because then, like, you go to a regular restaurant. This is like, so there's some Indian restaurants that are in um, Olympia where I love going on their, like, lunch specials because they give yeah. you a big, huge plate with, like, all the different things and, like, small portions. Mm. Yeah, I take everything I said back. No, I, I, I agree think with that you those are all valid now. points about it. And yeah. I have definitely, you know, there are definitely things that people do at, at I buffets. I think that's, but like, the, the uh, idea of a buffet maybe is for that. Yeah. But then it became the, yeah, the eating contest. <laughs> Like eating against nobody, because nobody See wins. See how much you can eat. When you eat too much, nobody wins. It's not like you're beating them. Yeah, the restaurant loses, you lose. Yeah. Everyone. If you win, in quotes, you've you know pretty much lost. <laughs> <laughs> you're gonna be the, s- the sicker of uh, whoever you're competing yeah. against. But they don't even have that. I want to go to uh, JJ North, or is that one? Is that what it's called? Old Country Buffet. Old, old Country Buffet, because JJ North is gone now. Maybe we should find one while we're down here. There is one called uh, the Golden Corral down here. Oh, yeah. yeah. Oh, really? I want to go there, yeah. actually, but I was just talking about how Super I don't want to go there. But Notorious. maybe I do. You should do it. I would do that. I remember they have they have uh, like ham and roast beef and turkey. <laughs> <laughs> you should get it all. <laughs> yeah, you can get it all. Mm-hmm. Ice Everything. Ice yeah. And ice cream. I always ate ice cream. Every time I got any regular food, you get ice cream also. Sips. Right, each time you go <laughs> yeah. back. Maybe we should go. Is there, is there one around? There's like so much I want to eat already that it's like hard <laughs> to do like, while we're down here. There's one, yeah, probably on the freeway. Oh. Back. We'll have to check it out. We should record a message uh, to the future. If we can get this thing going, we're going to have to cue the tape up and stuff. It's like, oh yeah. Oh, tuna! Road tape. We can also look at the road tape maybe, but I don't know if we'll... No. The, road, the road tape would have some of the, uh, you could hear some of that uh, DVD we were listening to on the way. Oh, yeah. Can you tell about Tuna trying to go on the escalator? Oh, yeah. Uh, she went on her first escalator ride today by accident. I was on the phone and I had her on a leash, so she was following me. And she stopped, <laughs> like before getting on the escalator and refused to get on and I totally understood. Can you imagine how futuristic an escalator looks? Like, have you ever seen yeah. one? So then what? I didn't realize what was happening. I was like, oh god, I'm about to hurt my dog. This sucks. And then I had to walk backwards. I was on the phone and my mom didn't know what was happening. I was talking to her. But this one? Yeah. One of those doesn't rewind so good. I wonder, do you guys remember what, we, what happened last year we actually were here? We came to your your spot um, last year. Remember what, what happened on that? When we were... Hey, there was construction going on. Look, we're oh, Do you remember the far. person oh. outside the window? Yeah, the construction people. That's yeah. right. Yeah. That shot was cool. They were taking like the wall siding stuff off yeah. or whatever it was. Sunny day. All the families were playing. Yeah. It was a great time. No, yesterday. Oh. Don't fall down. <laughs> Man, time dilates yeah, weird when you drive uh, so this far. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Every day. Crazy. All right, we're gonna move this one down. We're gonna record a message to the future. It's this one, right? Yeah. I'm gonna do this and say. So you have a record VCR and then a play VCR. Yeah, we say, hey, future. Hey, future. Mm. Fast. Here we are. Hey. Hey. What do you have to say to the future? Uh, let's see. You're doing good. What day is it? What do you have to say to the future? Today's the 11th. It's Sunday. Uh, I want to say, uh, keep hanging in there. Famous people. We're in LA and it's uh, uh, Miracle Mile. Mm. Miracle Mile, it's Sunday. That's right. Maybe you should go eat a donut or something. Buffets are about variety, not about eating as much as you can. Yes. Bye. Bye. All right. <laughs> <laughs> now we move this thing up here. I guess we can take a look. We can see where we've been. Yeah, you want to see where we've. Oh, yeah, we should take a look at what the tour's been like so far. Yeah. Um. Yeah. Hello. Leisure World, Eric. They were here. Like when. This is good. 
Where, where's those other guys? Uh, home. The east side. They're in Highland Park and Orange County. Well, they, have, they live in hip neighborhoods. Mm. I've heard of all these places. It's kind of crazy because uh, L.A. is so familiar just from television mm -hmm. and movies and stuff. So you just kind of know the area even though you don't know it that much. Yeah. Yeah. Hey, yeah, everything's really close to each other and really far from each other. Yeah, this thing is hard to, it's, you can't really see the rewind part of it. That'd be yeah. yeah. Uh, Which it's also only in EP mode. I think, you know, maybe we can still replace that VCR too. We're testing stuff out, but is it hey, the only place? Hey, future. Oh, wait, wait. here we go. Oh, this is, this is like What's Tuesday. So. Well, it's too far back, right? Yeah, it's Tuesday. Tuesday. Wednesday. Wednesday. Oh, Wednesday. Oh, yeah. Future. It's us, the past. What should I tell the future? Yeah, what do you have to say to the future? Man, like just uh, Giannis Atacupo is a very exciting basketball player future. And you in the future, Miller? he'll probably be even better. It's Wednesday yeah. and Sam's here and we're about to go on the road. Bye, future. Bye. Bye, Bye future. Kick rocks, future. That was Wednesday. Kick rocks. Got it. Maybe. Maybe. Yeah. We're here at Shea. Wait, oh man, Shapey J's gone? We're here at Shapey J. Shapey J. And, uh, oh, no, it's not gone. It's got like, here we go. We're at Shapey J. Yep. Did we do this right? I hope not. Yeah, we did. It's the first day of the tour. Okay, bye, future. Looks right. pretty good. Yeah, good job. Passed. Did you draw that with a pixel That's marker? Yeah. Pixel hey, marker. Hey, future, it's us the past. Look, we're at Burgerville. Cool. We we're driving around doing the program we can here on the road, and the, the show's car. about over. And I guess we're going to be the end of the message to the future and the end of the program, kind of. So, bye, future. That's bye. Beautiful. And... Is there more? There's one more. And then we got today, too. Oh. Ooh. Oh. <laughs> yeah. Hey, future. Hey, future. Sure. It's us, the past. We're here in Willows, California. Oh, this is a great day. What park is this? It's uh, Jensen Park. Jensen Park. There's a cute yeah. spider. And got a little field set up here and a beautiful sunny day. Well, we climbed in our bag, but I guess yeah. it got out <laughs> somewhere. Long way. No, and then here's the for today. <laughs> Earlier today. Bye bye. Yeah, right, we'll later tomorrow, maybe? Wait, this one? Yeah. That was today? No, this is today. Right here. Say, hey, future. Oh. Hey, future. Mm. Well, Fast. Hey, here we are. Hey. Okay. What do you have to say to the future? Well, it's kind of glitchy. Uh, let's see. You're doing good. What day is it? That's okay. What do you, I think the, somehow the mics are affecting the, the TV uh, more than they, uh, just more than the TV. In there. That's fun though. Famous people. We're well, in LA. It's uh, 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 Miracle Nile. Mm -hmm. Miracle Nile. Mm -hmm. Right. Uh, Maybe you should go eat a donut or something. Buffet. Why would you eat a donut? Variety, not about eating. Because they're good. Oh, yeah. Yes. But is that Bye. Bye. Just no. like go eat them future to the future. Just, just like eat one. Hey, future, eat donut. You know? Yeah, that's good advice. I saw a donut place. Isn't there one like right over there? There's or? one right by here that's so good. We should go. Then we was there like a donut? You like told us to go to the donut place. I like donuts a lot too. Like there's like donuts place by your old place too, right? Like last year. Oh, maybe. But this one is uh, a little bit newer in my consciousness, and it's so fucking sorry, so good. Ooh. It's okay. We can say of course. Oh yeah, you, you can. can. Remember Mr. Ginsu? Yes. Ooh, yeah. He cursed up his car. Maybe we should call him actually, because he might want to talk to you. Didn't okay. we try? Oh no, we just got. What's uh? Called, Grandma. What kind of donuts they got over there at the new one? Um, I don't know. It's just like a place that has really nice donuts. It's not too pretentious, and then they mm. have some vegan ones. But it's just one of those places where the donuts are just insanely good. It's, What's called, it's called SK for anyone oh yeah. who's watching in Los Angeles. Sk what animal products are in donuts? Uh, fat. Oh, like what kind of fat? I always wonder, yeah, is, are they fried? Oh, no, yeah. I think it's eggs. Eggs are in the batter. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Definitely eggs, yeah. I forgot about eggs. There's a spot in Olympia now called Dew's Donuts that does really good vegan donuts. You know, like... Your call has been forwarded to an automatic voice message system. Oh, Three, six, zero, five, six. Available. Hi, Mr. Ginsu. This is Jessica calling from the program. It's because you can call us back. We're still in California. <sighs> Hope you're having a, a decent day, night, and life. <laughs> you breathing really hard into the mic. Oh, that, oh. Here, here, wasn't it? Uh, 
Bye, Mr. Ginsu. Bye, Mr. Ginsu. Yeah. How's Mr. Ginsu doing? He's doing okay. He's in Oregon. He, his, did you know that he got healed? Oh. You know that he was so oh. messed up? Yeah, I know he wasn't doing too well. He was like messed up from the entire time we talked to him until maybe what two years ago or so. And what was I want to know about the healing process? Maybe he can talk about it. Well, he, what he said, yeah. he did talk about it. Well, didn't he just he, first he got a back shot and then he said that it didn't do anything, right? Oh, you right? think it was a shot? I don't know. He got a he got a back shot. That it was like, like when you're like Sorry. gonna have a baby and they put like a shot in your spine. Epidural. Yeah. Epidural. He got yeah, he got an epidural. <laughs> and then, and then he was like complaining about how it didn't do anything. Oh. And then later he's like, I popped my back or something, he right? He said he like was like sitting on a weird chair or something, and then he stood up and like his hip popped back into place, and then everything was fine. I mean, I can really have I have bad hips and joint problems, and you know, when you get your back cracked, like the world's a shinier place. So oh yeah. Maybe that's what it was, but. But he, he, he was healed. like bedridden, and then one day his hip popped oh. back, and then he's fine, <laughs> which seems totally crazy. But he seems to be fine because now he's like working physical labor and stuff. Oh yeah. Oh. And we think he's working out of jail, but he don't want to tell us mm -hmm. specifically. I don't know why I think he's working out of jail. Mm. But. That was like my guess. Well, we'll just have to assume so unless he tells us otherwise, huh? Yeah, he's doing some kind of physical labor somewhere. Open-handed punches. Yeah, he's punching something too. Open-handed. I'm like, what are you punching? And he's like, uh, hard to s hard to say. That's what he says. <laughs> what are you punching? Hard to say. It's hard to say. <laughs> so, okay. It's <laughs> a really great character. Yeah. Such a good standing character in a show. Yeah, he's been around the whole time. Oh yeah, and he went. You, were you around when he <laughs> kind of went crazy? <laughs> oh, yeah. I know that he met up with a daughter or something, right? Oh. Oh, yeah. He had, like, the his lost was, love. Yeah. Okay, so it's different. There was also he we're just yeah, recapping everything, Mr. Ginsu. I'm sorry. That's it's, good. Yeah, Mr. Ginsu doesn't really <laughs> watch too much anymore, I think. But there was... Uh, oh, he might watch this one, though, because of uh, you. And we told him to. But, um... Me. Yeah. Uh... But I don't think I'll watch it anyway, actually. But he did go kind of crazy. Like, this was a few years ago. He was, like, seeing... Well, he was, like, seeing maggots. Yeah. He saw, like, bugs or something. Like, he was... They were all over, which, like... And it, like, he thought that, like, he saw the wallpaper, like, moving in a weird way. And he got closer, and it was, like, all these bugs. But... He said maggots, though. He was maggots. Like, yeah. But I don't think they were real maggots because then he also was at the same time starting to get these like paranoid, leaving these paranoid messages where he was like talking about guns and rights. And then also, remember, he was like, you got to answer my question. If you don't answer my question, I'm gone or something mm. like oh, that. Oh, yeah. And what, what question? Right? And he didn't, we didn't know what the yeah. question was. <laughs> <laughs> and we're like, okay, we better figure out what the question was so we know the answer. I was like, oh, like yes. Mr. Gensu, the answer is yes to your question or whatever. And, yeah. Oh, yeah. Because no, we called him. He's like, what's the answer to my question? And, <laughs> and then I think you said yes. And then he hung up. Oh, yeah. Or something. Oh, maybe it was something bad then. Maybe I don't I, know, I'm yes not, sure. not the right answer. But I don't think he, you said yes. I'm not. He I bailed for like a year or something. Yeah, he, almost. He, he disappeared for a while after that. But <laughs> I was there when he, I was there when he returned. Oh, it was yeah. just like a random message. Yeah, and it was miraculous, and now he's back. Again. Back in full form. So Seems was better that than before ever. Before he was healed, though. No, it was before he was healed. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And now he's healed, so he's doing much better. But now he's got like other problems. When you, you said healed, I thought it was like a spiritual healing. So <laughs> what you're telling me is the spirit is still a little out of whack. No, his spirit. I think his spirit is actually well. Maybe he's able to focus on his spiritual problems now. He has less physical problems, but he's got a lot of spiritual problems now. Because <laughs> he's in middle in middle school, he he thinks so. He had like he he says he had a girlfriend in middle school, and that his teacher and his girl's mother separated them, and he thinks that it was going to be the love of his life, and he thinks that it was like a big thing, and that he's upset about this thing that happened mm -hmm. in maybe like the 80s. Mm. They separated them, and now his life. They ruined his life. Yeah, they ruined his like life, he and he's yeah. like always talking about revenge. And I'm telling him finding that her. I did find her, though. You shouldn't. You shouldn't want revenge because you know you're gonna get revenge, and then you're not gonna. It's not gonna be any different. Yeah. And you should forgive. That's good. Yeah. 
Sounds like an unhealthy fixation, yeah. Mr. Ginsu. If you're listening, it's you should consider moving on. Move on, forgiveness. That's a good uh, word of advice. Yeah. I'm just uh, thinking the fact that he might watch this someday. I don't oh know. yeah. Yeah. But, but there's so many things to move on to. I mean, isn't that the better perspective? It's like yeah. so many things to experience in the world. But sometimes maybe you've experienced them all. We're getting, yeah, we're, we're getting down to we'll have about four minutes left oh today. No. What are we going to do? Should we, should, we take, you know, should we take a look at some of the whatever we're doing in, on this tape? Let's look in the, yeah, let's take a look at the road tape. Okay. We're taping this stuff on the road. You know, the thing about maggots made me, remind me of that movie. Have you seen the rotoscope movie, A Scanner Darkly? Yeah. Oh, I have seen that. I don't remember much was about it. it I wonder if he thought he was on drugs for a second. Oh, maybe. He uh, that sounds like someone on speed for sure. Yeah, bed bugs. I don't remember that. Oh, we were talking about die tremors Earth or something. That one. An inconvenient truth. Woo! How far we went to the? I'm gonna probably want to get back. Still oh, in Olympia? You, you, you like actually left the camera on for a while too, right? Cool. Like how long did you leave it on for? <laughs> we have this thing, it plugs into the cigarette lighter now, so. Oh, nice. They still call it like the cigarette, maybe like in the future the kids aren't going to know what cigarettes are. Yeah, like the they're still going to call it like car. The vape charging car. station. Yeah. <laughs> Is that, that's in LA? Yeah. yeah Two little dog. Where's that Baker's? We went to Bakersfield and then went to this place and it said corn, they had a corn dog and it was filled with a K. And corn, the band, is from Bakersfield. And I think that they either, either corn yeah. named themselves after this corn dog place or the other way around. Well, I, think I, think the other way around. I think the other way around. They probably can get away with it because corn spells it with the backwards. Yeah. Backwards all out. It's not both, <laughs> or is it no. only on? No, K is forwards, R is backwards. Oh, okay. Are you guys going to pass through Barstow yeah. at all? Oh, really shit, like a coconut. Taco. It's kind of, I think it, only if you were going to Vegas would you oh, pass through. the end of it. Oh, yeah. Yeah, we're not, Barstow. We're not going to Vegas. Oh, oh it's a worth a stop. Mm -hmm. The yeah. first we're Del Taco uh -huh. of all time is in Barstow. Actually, the first two. I had some and they are, it's the best Del Taco. If you guys are not on the Del Taco train they already. Are. Not okay. yet. Well, we haven't gone to any yet. Uh, we're kind of doing a lot of in and out. But there's like Del Taco's like not Burger in places. Yeah, Del Taco's like in Vancouver, Washington. I'm sure those do not compare. They don't compare. We're mostly going to places Honestly, that don't have. Yeah, the, the difference between Los Angeles Del Tacos and even Orange County Del Tacos is stark. I the heard, yeah, where, like, is, like, the mountains, is that the, there's, like, I heard there's some kind of spot where it's, like, different ownership or something. That's probably true. But Barstow, they have special menu items because they are the original Del Taco. Ooh. Oh my God. Everything is just bigger. Um, and it's, yeah, it's yeah, worth a stop. It's worth going just for that. Like oh, they have bun tacos. Oh, right, yes. It's like a sloppy gym. Yeah. I don't know why it's called a tap. It's just ground beef on a bun. The main difference between Del Tacos is just the Chinese little details. Like if you get like a Oh, is that Rocky Erickson's house? The other one is like the cheese is too much. It's not on documentary, it looks like it's weird. Maybe actually. Yeah, ratios are important. It's really Who's Rocky Erickson? That's good. Uh, what is this? Something else. Is it's about oh, over, so thanks. I really like Rocker. Uh, <laughs> yeah. I wanted to say something about uh, like some of those little towns we've been in. Oh, we yeah, have Flip It. Mm -hmm. Which is like, what, Drain? And, cur cur was it Curtain? Yeah. Yeah, Curtain. There was one other one. Drain, Curtain, and... Uh, mm -hmm. Oh, we should, yeah, we should, we should there's a town called Drain. Drain, yeah. yeah. It's called Drain, it's called Curtain. Yeah. There's another. There's Taft. Taft, yeah. Mm -hmm. uh, what about them? Good names. Yeah, just their names. <laughs> 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 Thanks, uh, 
Jessica and Eric <laughs> for course. having us, and uh, Grandma and Dad and Andrew. Tell her I said hi again. Um, is that everybody that we talked to today, right? Thank you to Miracle Mile. Goodbye. Oh, here it is. The nuggets are done. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Can you flip it back? Oh. Thanks for watching. Call in. Right now. It's Sunday. Oh, you don't you don't do the talk that uh, not happens until later. We're on Jesus TV Channel 22, 11, 30, and 2 a.m. Check that out. What is Yeah. 360 or 234 if I'll leave a message to get on TV. Oh, 109 State number 3 at the address back there in Thurston County. Send us some mail. Very, very good song. Thank you. Here it is. TCTV, La Bebe, Jody, Capital, Shrem, Grand, Test, Five, Clouds, I'm looking at this kind of what to say. USA, thank you, and viewers. And California, too, now. Hell yeah, dog.